kids, welcome to Funky Sats. I'm Professor TJ. And her sister Nelly Welly. And today we have a gruesomely gooey experiment for you. <laughs> but before we continue, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel. But before we start, let us tell you something about this Halloween <laughs> experiment. In this experiment, we're going to make flying ghosts using a tea bag. Can't wait to show you what we have. For this experiment, you will need tea bags, a pair of scissors, a heat proof surface, markers, a lighter. And remember, kids, Always have an adult present as you're doing this experiment. Safety first! All the time. Especially with fire. So Nelly Welly. Yes. Ready to start? Mm -hmm. So let's start this experiment. First, we'll take our tea bags. Yes. And then cut. And then I want you to draw like a scary ghosty figure. Scary ghosty figure. You want what color? Thread. Fantastic. Have you drawn your gruesome ghost? Ho 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 So then, mm -hmm. we're going to put our ghost. Your ghost, your ghost is scary. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. And then now, are you ready? Mm -hmm. Let me roll it up. It's like my ghost. <gasps> and my ghost is flying. Oh my. Oh no. It's good your ghost as well. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. So how exactly are our ghosts taking flight in such a spectacular way? When you light the tea bag, the heat from the fire causes the air molecules inside the tea bag to become energized and move around quickly. The air molecules inside the tea bag are moving so fast that they spread up and out of the tea bag. This makes the air inside the tea bag less dense or less lightly packed together than the colder more tightly packed air outside the tea bag. I hope you at home were able to do this Halloween experiment. This is all we have for you today. See you next time on Funky Science. Bye.